My sweet goats, I'm super excited about this video that you're about to watch because it's one of those rare occasions where a developer invited me to go ahead and check out the pre-alpha build of their game. And the best part is, is that I get to share it with you. It's called Proteus and it's a first person shooter that's kind of like a love letter to Doom with some added features that translate over kind of well with the, you know, the newer aesthetic and uh, overall look of the game. It's like a game six year old Bunty would have pissed his pants over. Not in an oh my god, I'm so scared, f my ass kind of way. But in a man, this game is so relaxing kind of way. So yeah, I'm excited to share this game with you and talk about it. And before you ask, look, don't, don't worry, okay? I haven't been paid to talk about it. I'm just excited about it because I like games like this and it's nice to see good independent projects. So do you want me? Do you want me, your favorite cute boy on the internet? Do you want me? playing this game for you. Now before we begin, I wanna go ahead and draw attention to the top left corner where it says pre-alpha build for Bunty King. They made this alpha build for me because I'm the best. And you can see I'm the best, okay? This here is something you may recognize from the announcement trailer, which was either, I don't know, late last year, or early this year. I don't remember exactly when it was because honestly, I've been playing so many games. I've been playing tons of games. But you know, I'm looking forward to this game. It's been, it's, it's been on my radar for quite a while right now. These guys got mashed up. Look at their bodies. Disgusting, bro. Disgusting. Get out of here. Of course, as I mash them up, the blood gets spread everywhere because uh, it's, it's really honestly quite wonderful. This blood is beautiful. It really is, okay? I'm not a crazy dude that needs to see blood in every single game, but this is a power fantasy, okay? This game is for is designed for the alpha gamer in mind, okay? And, and the developers were like, what is the alpha gamer going to want to see? They're going to want to see a lot of blood. And what color of blood will we need to put in so that they don't get tired of seeing this same blood splattered everywhere? And they found the perfect color. Look at this dirty, disgusting crimson red. Beautiful. It's kind of shiny. It's so nice. It's so nice. It's so nice. And uh, and here's another little neat touch that they have in the game. You press down your map button, which is a T on the keyboard or or whatever else it is on the game on the gamepad. You actually see your map, and it'll show you where you've been based upon the blood that you splattered everywhere. And even show it literally is precisely placed wherever you play. It's cool. Really cool feature. I like it. They call this the live map feature, which is pretty chill. You can ADS weapons, which is also pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and get a secret right here. Uh, gotta, gotta hop over the lava so we take not as much damage, which is great. Still have my armor intact a little bit. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna use that ammo for, which I just got. Oh, I should specifically kind of show you what, what's going on here in the UI. Uh, if you look over here on the left, you'll see that uh, you have five slots for weapons. I'm pretty sure you're gonna have a little bit more uh, in, the, in the full game, but in this, in this demo, you got your fists, you got a pistol, you got a shotgun, and you have a minigun, and then you have a rocket launcher. If you look on the right, you'll see your ammo counts, light ammo, uh, shotgun ammo, uh, rocket ammo, energy ammo, and nuclear uh, ammo. I'm not really sure what that's used for. I haven't seen a gun that, uh, that, uh, that, that uses that. Also, I haven't discovered all the secrets in this demo yet, uh, but we're not going to be trying to do that. I just want to show you what this, this game is like. So you can ADS with your pistol, which is pretty cool. If you have your fists out, uh, you can uh, spam a left and right click to actually throw left and right hooks, which is really, really, really effective. You'll see how fast you can take things out. Just completely destroy them. Just completely destroy them. This guy's going to spawn in. He won't even have any time to react. Look at me. Look at me. I'm a monster. Disgusting. These guys think they're monsters. I'm the monster okay that's what i am is this you're seeing this game in action right now you're seeing the what 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 psychological effects this game has on me right now and it's it's exactly as intended you know it, it's a power fantasy you know makes you feel powerful makes you feel real good look at that dude gets like imagine spawning in next to a, an explosive barrel like how stupid are you look at that shot his uh shot the top part of his body off i'm not sure how the hitboxing works though so I need to like need to need to figure that out. But I I feel, I feel like every character has like five no six hitboxes I would say. Yeah, I'm thinking six hitboxes. They got the torso, they got the head, they got the arms and uh, the legs. So yeah, so I'd say six hitboxes. Uh, I'm gonna go and get a headshot on this guy. Boom! Headshot on him. Headshot on that dude. Oh no! No 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 no! Oh there you go. I shot the top part of his body off because I got his torso. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's hard to get leg shots on these dudes. Oh boy, those guys got destroyed. Leg sh shot that dude's... Oh my god, man. For the most part, I find with these dudes, if you shoot out their legs, they fall down right away and they die. So you see, like, right there, dead. Boom. This guy... 
also dead too. So leg shots are key with these dudes. Um, I tried shooting this dude's arm off. I think he was still alive. Yeah, he's. <laughs> he doesn't want to go. He wants to keep going. Oh, he can't. Oh. I think he figured out that his his right arm wasn't connected to his body anymore. So he was like, he was like, uh, he decided he'd go ahead and use that. Uh, we're gonna go and get the uh, minigun first, which is right here. So we're gonna flap this dude right now. Oof, dude, disgusting. All right, let's see. Oof, disgusting. Real good, real good, real good, real good. I love this. I love, absolutely do enjoy this. Game feels very, very fluid, guys. Really does. Movement feels fluid. Sometimes the doors are a little finicky, but it's okay. It's not a big deal. Oh, shit, this guy right. Oh my god, I got scared. <laughs> I actually got scared, bro. Oh, man. Uh, in terms of fear factor in this game, I don't know if that it, it actually exists. I'm just a little bit of a baby sometimes. Uh, but uh, this guy needs to lose his legs. I don't know what these things are called, but they're they're pretty gross looking. There we go. They put uh, they, they 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 put on they put some kind of thing that like does damage over time on a, in a specific area. Let's go and grab this. If you hold down right click while using your uh, minigun, it actually uh, just keeps it revved. So you just need to like press uh, press down on the left click anytime you want to like maybe pop a shot or two. I don't know what those things are called in Doom, but uh, as you can see, this game is very, 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 very inspired from Doom. Very inspired. It's everything, you know, you know, teleporting in and all that. This game favors aggression. You want to be aggressive? You'll do well. You know, you play the, you play like a baby. You'll, you'll probably still do okay, but it's not going to be as fun or as fun to watch. Oof, dude, these guys didn't even like have a chance. Such terrible lives. The yellow, yellow key right here. It's over. Oof. <laughs> I love when something spawns in, and it doesn't even have time to live. Yeah, with the with the uh, with the uh, this this dude right here, this little uh, this little weapon here, this beautiful weapon. You, uh, you want to, you definitely want to keep it revved. Oh, I didn't spawn that thing this time. Interesting. Oh, that's cool. Get another weapon right here. We got ourselves a rocket launcher. That's quite nice. We can use the rocket launcher right now. These guys are gonna be like, oh, you can't go this way. I can, and I will. You're gonna let, you're gonna let me go. Beautiful. All right, Gordon here. This is really weird for me because I've never really done a traditional let's play. I mean, I have back in the day, but like it's been a while. It's been a real while. I'm never sure what I should be saying. Should I be really entertaining for you guys? Should I be talking nonstop? Should I be like, hey guys, let's do what I'm doing right now. Look at this. I'm checking. I'm like. I don't know, I just don't, I don't get it, uh, so, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna play the game. I'm just gonna play the game and kind of, like, buy commentary whenever I see fit. The level design is pretty interesting. In the sense that it's re it really is, it really does feel like a, uh... See, I just lit those dudes on fire because ADS, uh, ADS shotgun will light dudes on fire, which is pretty cool. There's damage over time. It's pretty nice. Oh man, <laughs> what a miss. That dude's head popped open, that's beautiful. Let's 
Let's get more of that ammo. Okay, we're fully stocked on ammo, which is quite wonderful. Let's just spawn a little rat over here. So look, I, I'm not sure how you guys are how you guys are feeling right now, but uh, but this is cool. This is enjoyable. This is a game that I feel a lot of people would value. Right now, what I'm about to get right now, uh, here is uh, is a uh, is a full map. You'll see a full map. It'll let me do a full map now, so I can see everything in the level. Uh, I'm not sure what that is over there. Oh, I know what that is. Okay, that's probably just a shotgun. Like, I have no idea what this is. Like, no clue what that is at all. Like, is that... What's that yellow icon? It's a key item. It's easy to get lost in this map. It really is. What is that? I'm going to check it out. So that's the main area. Where am I right now? Okay, right there. Oh, that's where we start. That's where we can start. Disgusting. I think this is where we're gonna get the green key. Oh shit, are you kidding me? Fuck, dude. I'm gonna go all the way back now. Look at these guys. Bye. I think that thing... I think that thing, uh... got, uh... rushed a little. Okay, sorry. Oh, look at that. What's this? In the secret, I believe. Oof. Disgusting. Oh, would you look at that? We're way up. Well, I could have gotten the green key right away. That's interesting, unless that wasn't there before. That beauty, beauty. Oof! What a terrible life. Terrible, terrible, terrible life. Come on! 
Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. Shot that thing's head clean off. There goes his leg. Beautiful. I'm loving it. Okay, let's go uh, and call in the final wave. I think that we are done. We are done with this uh, with the demo. We got. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna bust out the. Uh, Mad, bro. Oh boy, I have no idea what's going on here. What's happening here? Am I gonna die? I better not die. I swear to God, man, I better not die. Man, okay, okay. I was just, I, man, I was just talking shit about it, how easy this game was. <laughs> I almost died. I almost died. That would have been embarrassing. <laughs> well, there you guys have it, man. That's it. That is the uh, demo for uh, for uh, uh, Proteus. I hope you guys enjoyed that. 16 minutes. That was 16 minutes. That flew right by. I had no idea that was 16 minutes. I felt like that was like five or six. Actually, I'm exaggerating. It felt more like 10, okay? So, game is fun. Game's fun. Hope you enjoyed the gameplay. Although it's in its early stages, I'm excited about this game. It taps into something from my childhood, so I really do appreciate it in that regard. I honestly believe that this game has potential to bring a great deal of value to gamers, to people in the independent gaming market. And look, uh, if you're interested in supporting them, they've got a Kickstarter going on that ends in just a little bit. And hey, they hit their goals, but I wanted to let you know that the option is there and I wanted you to have a look at this project. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a like, hit the sub button, hit it. Just hit the sub button, okay? Don't hit it too hard, but hit it hard enough so that you actually hit the sub button. And of course, ding the bell icon so you get notified anytime I put out a video. If you want to see me, on a more regular basis, you really do enjoy watching me, you wanna be around, you wanna to talk to me, you wanna vibe off of me, you, you wanna chill, you just wanna chill. Feel free to go ahead and drop by twitch.tv slash MrBuntyKing where I stream daily video games. Video games, video games. Uh. Until next time, I love you. Bye.